what is going on it's your boy craig the Krog. i've been gone for a while i'm sorry to all all the people that have subscribed to me i apologize right off the bat i haven't i haven't got anything noteworthy to give you i haven't got any polls all my packs got 82s in them just that haven't haven't really uh, got anything good and when i did it, it was off it was off camera as they say so it didn't really happen but what i can show you guys is from is it worth it lately i didn't record it but i've been i've been ripping those packs pretty much on the daily and from is it worth it or doing the uh the trade-in sets they change it again on me. Here we go. So this is a new edition. I just got him today. Boom, December 10th. Depending on when you're seeing this video, December 11th. So that that is pretty awesome. And uh, that is a very nice card. A lot of stats in the 90s, as well as Phil the Thrill. So that's what I've been getting from. Is it worth it? And uh, if you don't know what that is, that's when I do the gold trade-in sets. That's what I've been getting from sets. So just uh, just a little recap there. I don't think there's anything anything too. Oh no, I did get Eric Carlson. Eric Carlson, I got him as well. I got two always in the same day. These are all pretty much from doing the sets, guys. The gold re-rolls and the common trade-ins. And uh, I mean, you can get some pretty decent stuff, as you can see. Right, so let's change that to gold rare. None of those guys, but uh, the OV, Phil the Thrill, Perrant, Smith, Smith again, Smith again, McDavid. I've had McDavid for so long. Check this out. What's going on with McDavid? I've had for him for 270 games. Since October 13th. It was worth a lot more on October 13th. Brad Park, Eric Carlson, Wrist Line In, that was from doing the challenges. Ekblad, Park again, a couple of Ovies. Ivan, got Bark off there, Pat LaFontaine, Tyler Sagan, Drew Doughty, John Tavares, Victor Hedman. And then it goes down from there. We got Kopitar, Busick, Subban. I got Subban a couple times, a couple of Stammers, McKinnon, Bauer, Carlson. Subban's there again. Drew Doughty's there again. Kucherov's there. Is that Hedman again or is that no? Okay. And then it then it goes down. I got Kachuk. That was that was a while ago. That was a while ago I got Kachuk. I guess I never really used them. I think I had the other Halloween Kachuk, that's why came out around the same time but yeah these are and then I re-roll a lot of them you gotta keep re-rolling all right boys I just wanted to show you that real quick and then uh, check this out now I've been saving these up and uh, I've been grinding I've been playing since the game came out I got it early you know when uh, because you could get it early if you bought a certain edition the, like, the deluxe edition so anyways, we're at 40,000, so we're gonna do that right there. That brings us to how much? All right, 41,800. In the progression, I got 350 hits. So that should bring us close to 50,000, I believe. There we go. See, the, the grind is real out here, boys. The grind is real. So we just made 10K. And then this event, finished off the event. Can't even go look at what I did, but there was a lot of stuff in that event, and then boom, right here. There he is, your boy Theo Flurry. There's another 20k, and uh, complete hut challenges to get 89 Andy Moog. That was uh, 250 challenges, just like that. So now we're up from 40k to 67,000. That is not too shabby. Still working on those 10,000 shots, and uh, it's gonna take a while to get Chris Chelios. You know that's, that's how good. We almost got this whole thing done here, and it's, uh, it's December 10th or December 11th, depending on where you, where you are. Almost got Terry Sawchuk. Uh, almost, almost. That'll, that'll take a little while, but getting there. 
and uh, yeah so let's go check out these two new additions boom boom and uh, let's just throw that in there these are some guys I, I don't know what I'm doing with these I'm just I figure something's gonna happen with these evolutions so I'm just keeping them out of the way and then uh, Nick Schultz uh, is a diamond card apparently but I don't know what that's for I packed two in one day and packed another one and said, okay I'll keep them anyways so we got uh, Theo Fleury so that's pretty awesome it's five six probably the one of the smallest guys that has an NHL card but uh, you know he's pretty he's pretty quick he's got a decent wrist shot and um, so I'm gonna try him out you know he was pretty amazing when he played for the Flames funny story I actually sat in a movie theater when I was about 19 or 20 and watched a movie next to Theo Fleury and his wife I believe that was his wife he was my girlfriend at the time and me and I was in Calgary and I sat next to Theo Fleury but that was that was quite a few years ago it was probably 15 years ago all right and then uh, Andy Moog I don't even remember what movie it was I feel like it had something to do with maybe like possibly like a action movie with uh, superheroes maybe I don't know but I don't even remember so this is a pretty speed card because it has BU it has T and TB so that's got three synergies I don't know if I'm gonna use it I hear it's not very good but I am going to put it in as a backup so this says December 11th on it so I guess technically EA says it's December 11th I believe it's like nine o'clock or something. Um, yeah, it's 9.30, so yeah, it's, it's going to be December 11th, technically in like Eastern time, but whatever. Anyways, we got Theo Fleur, we got Andy Moog. That was a heck of a grind, boys. And I'm just curious, where are you guys at with your grind? Let me know, you know? But uh, yeah, that's, uh, I, fin I finally got these guys. And um, you know, that's uh, pretty awesome. It does, it does take some time. And it's not always the funnest thing to play against the uh, computer, but it can get you some coins and it can get you uh, two unopened packs. Okay, I don't know what this is. Oh, so I got a gold pack. Well, we might as well rip it. Rip these pizzies. I guess that's just from doing the... Uh, anything good for your boy Craig the Krog? Nada. Nada. Jacob De La Rose. Uh, and then some silvers and some junk and whatever and then we get this so I'll open that up maybe we'll get a captain oh it's untradeable anyway so it doesn't matter but that's cool Wichita Thunder I could rock that or the uh, Drummondville Vol Voltigers Voltigers <laughs> sorry about that hopefully that's a French word at least I'd like to think so you guys watch my channel you know I'm not big on pronunciation not my strong suit but anyways thought that was tradable to be honest but uh, yeah you can get quite a few uh, cool things when you when you grind it out this year and um, yeah so that's that's pretty awesome just want to check if I can you know you're still three hours away I just wanted to check but uh, yeah, so I just suggest doing the gold rare players to uh, gold collectible, doing the re-roll, and um, actually, let me drop some knowledge. Maybe you guys didn't know. This is this is totally worth it. I'm just gonna throw these in there real quick. But um, you guys didn't know, you can take old collectibles. Here, I'll show you. This is probably I'm sure everybody knows this, but there might be like a few guys out there that don't. So check this out. These are totally worth it. It's totally worth it to do the re-roll. And, uh, you know, just keep re-rolling until you get something good that goes on your team. But if you go into Christmas sets, you can you go to the very back. You can, um, you can take old collectibles. I don't have any. I just have December ones. But, like, if those were, like, September, I guess would, this would be silly to do this right here, obviously. But like, let's say... I did, I did like 16 of these because I had so many left over. So I do like three a day. Oh, really? 
Can you just take any of these? You know what? Let me try here. Just for the... Can, is that... Oh. Alright, well, that, that's fair. But, uh, single monthly collectible trade-in. Trade in any three single monthly collectibles for a single monthly collectible for the current month. So if you had a bunch of September, October, November that you didn't use, you could put them in here, right? And, um, right, just like that. And then you could do the set. And uh, maybe you guys didn't know about this. I know you probably did. I know you probably did. But in case you didn't, you can do that and you can get Bobby Clark, which is pretty cool. And uh, what's this here? You know, I'm gonna do this silver coach to gold coach. Really? Okay, sure. I, like, I don't know. Whatever. But I'm just trying to help with the Christmas thing. And then this thing right here, boom. So, but yeah, guys. I hope that the uh, here. You know what? Let's see if we get lucky with this real quick. There's and just just for the record, I don't edit my videos might be a downfall for some people but for me it's, it's just how I do it and it's a little more realistic I guess there's no like if I get something good or if I get something bad boom fiddler insert bacon country's line right there all right and then boom okay Kevin Waugh or Roy depending if he's well, he's probably Canadian but anyways um sometimes you can get something good there I've gotten like 84s out of three common golds and uh, yeah so let's just see this year why why it's worth it to do uh, milestones objectives and I just think this is like honestly the best year where EA was like hey we're gonna give you free stuff so all this was free I mean I didn't spend anything on this minus my time you know like that was 500 sets okay this guy's uh 500 objectives that was the month of i want to say let's see here i want to say october november november i believe that was november that was october and then this guy right here is uh september Mike Gardner was 2,000 goals. That was getting, just getting into Div 1, you get Tim Horton. And then uh, that was off a of re-roll, you know. Like, you got a team right here, man. You know, if you could, no matter what your skill level is, you, you could compete with this team right here. This is all just re-rolling, re-rolling. So, you know, just grinding out. Well, I think, honestly, this is the best year for getting free cards. Not saying the best year of hut, but the best year of free stuff. So I, I think that's pretty awesome. E, EA is doing that right. There might be some tweaks that are needed, but uh, you know, what are you gonna do, right? So let's go check out. Where's my Andy Moog? Andy Moog should be an 89. It should be right. Oh, my bad. See, maybe I should edit the videos. But no, Andy Moog and Theo Fleury should be kicking around, right? What, that's, what happened here? See, there's not two items here. That's that's confusing. But anyways, boom, boom. Send these to collection. And uh, that's just some more, some more guys to add to the squad. So let's see how the squad's looking, boys. You know, we got a half, we got a half decent team here. Not gonna lie to you. I need a Calgary center right there. That's oh, right there. That's what I need. I need a Calgary. I need like a Monahan 88. You know, and then I could throw Rona here. I, I can figure some stuff out. But uh, and just another one. This card goes for like 400 to 430. And if you got that kind of coin, I would say that Kucherov is so worth it. I mean, like Forsberg or like Solani like a 94 like you cannot get a 93 that's a, a value bargain price even even if you did uh, the set it's totally worth it the Christmas set to get Kucherov and the card is amazing so I just want to say you know that and this has been a pretty long video I might have to cut it down here but yeah that's the uh, that's how the squad's looking boys we're gonna throw Andy Moog in here possibly let's let's just throw you know what, here, I might sell that Hex doll. I might start Mike Smith. 
So anyways, let's, uh, Mike Smith is a little aggressive, though. That's the only thing about him. He's a little aggressive. Let's see what that, what the rating is now. We still got BU. Got this coach, uh, Pedersen, or Peter. That would be Peter. That would be Peter. So I'm thinking Pedersen as a player. But, um, yeah, so that's the squad, boys. And, uh, I think that, that, that about concludes it. Oh, you know what? That's not right. We still got to throw on our boy, uh, Theo Fleury. What's, you know what? I don't want to, what's his face off? 81? I can almost get away with that. I can almost, nah. I'm going to have to throw Theo Fleury where, uh, Phil the Thrill is. And, uh, okay. So, there we go. Just, just because he's a, a Flames alumni, you know? Gotta, gotta throw him in there, gotta try him out. And, uh, alright boys, that's, uh, that's what we're working with. And that is uh, Theo Fleury on December 11th. Alright boys, thank you for watching. You guys are amazing. I'm your boy Craig the Krog. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Help your boy out. I will see you in the next one. You guys are awesome. So stay awesome. Adios. Sayonara. See ya.